Welcome to Electron Line, and in this video we're going to learn how to draw the bisector or find the midpoint of a line segment. So here we have a line segment from A to B. We want to find the midpoint or we want to draw the line that will bisect that line from A to B. So again, we need a compass. Here's my compass. It's a string with a little loop on it. I put my pen right through it. Then I come to A, and I want to make the compass big enough so that's more than half the distance between A and B. That's obviously more than half the distance. I put my compass on one end, come up here, and I draw a little arc like this. I come down here, and I draw a little arc like this. All right, now I take my point. I make sure I keep the exact same length. I put my point at B, and I draw a little arc. Oh, and it should be at the, it should cross, and you can see that it did not cross. I have to go down a little bit more. So there's my arc right here, and there's my arc right there. So since I didn't cross it, I'll do that again. I come up here, I still have the exact same length. I come up here and I make sure that this crosses right there, and make sure that this crosses right there. Yeah, you can see that I moved a little bit, but that's all right. Close enough for hand drawn on the whiteboard. So now I have two lines that cross each other. They form two points, one point there and one point there. If I now go ahead and connect those two points right through the middle, and I might as well use red because it should not be part of the drawing. So I draw a line right through the middle like that. Okay, then this line will bisect the line segment from A to B. That means this distance from there to there is exactly the same as the distance from there to there. And that's what we call the bisector of that line segment, and that's how we do that. So for quick review, you go ahead and take your, your compass, and you make a little arc like that. Make sure that it's past the halfway point. It should be visible and uh, visibly past the halfway point. You draw a line, make sure you draw it long enough so that you know that you'll cross it when you do it from the other side. You do one at the bottom right here, then you come to the other side, then you do it again over here, do it again there. So you want to make sure that they cross each other. Where they cross, you connect the two, and that will then exactly bisect the line segment you want to find the halfway point of. And that's how it's done. 